There we go. For some reason, sometimes my microphone is not connecting. Hello everyone, welcome to another live stream. Hey Deacon. Ah. So I'm actually um, one hour late. <laughs> I was supposed to be here one hour ago, but then my daughter didn't want to, you know, to sleep and I fall asleep while trying to make her sleep and my wife was like, are you not supposed to stream? Like, hell yeah, I am. So, um, yeah. Hey Deacon, hey Eredev, hey uh, Isrudenel, good to see you all, man. Today, we're trying out a brand new MMORPG and I'm very excited to try it out. Just let me get my streamer light on, two seconds. There we go. That was much, much sharper. So, um, I don't know if you have played um, Throne of Liberty before, but um, it's a brand new MMO, which is only out in um, Korea right now. But if you do um, some stuff, you can play it as well. I'm just uh, picking the game. Wrong a liberty, there we go. Go live. I am just going live on TikTok right now. Uh, on my uh, Steam Deck. You know, this little Steam Deck here. It's basically, it's running a software, a piece of software called um, TikTok Live Studio, which is weird. But yeah, I don't want it on my main PC, so that's why my Steam Deck is running it. Okay, so first thing I need to do is I need to open up a program called ExitLag, which basically will make not my entire PC act like it's from Korea. It's only the, ap the application you pick that's going to behave like it's in Korea. It's pretty smart. It's like a it's like a VPN, but not a VPN if you know what I mean. It's it's only for like the, the selected application, which is super cool. Because if I had used a normal VPN, you know, then it would have been like um, um, there you go. Then it would also be my OBS, so it was actually all the be streaming in in um, a different country, but it's not. Okay, so now my VPN is running. Then we can open up the launcher for the game, which is called NC Soft Purple. 
And we can minimize my VPN. Okay, it wants me to log in again. Uh, all right. What's my password? NC soft. That's my password. I'm one of those hyper secure people who uses different password for anything. Can't use the same for any. Oh my god, I have to answer like 200 of those pictures where you have to re say you're not a bot. Okay. Are we getting in? Remember the next time open the game before you start stream. Come on. It's saying signing in. Signing in. Oh, there we go. Now I can see Throne of Liberty. How exciting. And we're just waiting for it to show the play button. Please. Where's the play button? Why is there no play button in my law? Oh, there we go. Start game. Start game. This is so exciting. Okay, so it's opening up the game right now, I believe. So I should be able to now in the game capture. Is it this one? Look at that. Look at that. Had you ever imagined you would see me play this game on my stream? This is the first time I ever hear my new PC going crazy. It's using 82% of my GPU. I've never seen it in my PC do that ever. might be this like a uh, loading screen here that it makes the PC go crazy okay so are you all ready for a new MMORPG a brand this is gonna be my first impression of this new MMORPG I'm gonna be um, throwing this this what we're doing right now I'm gonna be throwing that on YouTube later as a, like a first impression. So it's going to be quite interesting. Uh, I just need one more thing before I start. We're not going to play this character, don't worry. I was just testing the game if, if it actually worked. The game if, if... There we go. So is it... Is it working? If I go to my channel, go yep. to my channel, and it says "Throne of Liberty," and if we look at people who streams it, yep, nice. I guess we all ready. Uh, just popping out the chats so I can actually see the chats. 
Copying our chats. We want that to be fixed before we start playing the game. There we go. Live chat. And we just need quickly on my third screen. We need the TikTok chat. There we go. New game. So. All right. All right, all right, all right. Let's do it. So as you can see, the first thing you have to do is you have to pick a server. I do have a friend on the server here called Stone Guard. So we're going to pick that one. It's a fellow streamer called Rainbow. Hey monkey, go to stream. All right. The cinematics could be nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, frozen cup. The cinematics reminds me a bit of Final Fantasy Universe. Is coming. Okay, that's kind of started the story. Hello, with the name tag? Welcome to stream. Oh, you're playing to a Prone Liberty? Excellent. Was the setup all relatively flawless? I'm waiting on Europe release. You know, uh, it, it was a bit of a mess to set it up because you know, you need Epic uh, Exit Lag VPN, you need to buy the, the game. Um, you know, you need, you need to buy like an account on G2G. Um, but I hope it was all worth it. I just couldn't wait for playing the game. I, I needed to try it. And hey, monkey, good to see, uh, sorry. See you, see you later, monkey. Thank you for stopping by the stream and uh, thank you for leaving. <laughs> I'm missing with you. Have a good uh, time in uh, Enshrouded. The game actually looks good. So basically, this is Throne Liberty's character creation. For some reason, I have a thing with playing female characters. I just, I don't know, just, that looks so cool with two end swords because you know basically the two end swords are like bigger on them versus the male character. It's actually some pretty cool hairstyles you can get. This reminds me of um, Elsa, like you know, Frozen. With a name tag, yeah, I don't blame you. I'm looking forward to seeing your progress. Yeah, it's I'm, I'm very much looking forward to see this game. I'm kind of like um. Oh, so this is like resets. 
Ah, okay, yeah, we don't want to look at presets. Screw that. Okay, so we got like different options here. Normally I, build, I, I like these, but for some reason I don't like that one, so... I really like this one here. Yeah. So you can change like stuff with the eyes if you... Oh god. Different color eyes, yeah. Let's do that. So you, you can really go into details with everything if you want. Uh, or you could do like me where you just go for different presets. So I don't really care about like changing the nose, mouth, ears. Uh, you could do makeup, but... Nah, just no, no makeup. Body, can you like take off the cloth? Not because I want to see her without clothes, but you know, I just it kind of helps me. You're shaving the body. Oh, I can already see that I will be spending hours just on creating character. That's the thing, like, I've never been, like, good at stuff like that, it's, um... Ramberg. Ramberg GG just raided with 422 <laughs> views. Ramberg coming in with a big, big, big raid. Appreciate it, man. Thank you so much for that. Did you have a good stream, Rainberg? I was supposed to go live one hour earlier, but I fall asleep when trying to get my kids to sleep. Whoops. You probably know it. Uh, no problem. Yeah, I, I had <laughs> another feeling. Yeah, exactly. My wife came in and was like, are you not supposed to stream right now? Like, um, yes. Yes, I am. Okay, let's go with that. Hate. Let's do a small one. Head size. Let's just go with this standard one. Did you had a Did you had a good stream? Did you enjoy it? We'll be back in an hour or so. Will you be streaming again, or what are you What are you gonna do? I really like that one. Do you? I wonder if I keep this arm away if it's just like a preview. Yeah, I definitely did. Not just see how you like it. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm excited, man. I'm so excited. Okay, I think we got our my perfect character. You brought torso with. Bicep size. They can really do some sh funny stuff, huh? Yeah, see you, see you in a bit, Reinberg, and thank you so much for the raid, man. Appreciate it. Okay, I think we're ready. Start game. Graphics looks lush. What do you mean? Lush. Press E or right click to attack the target. While attacking, press X to stop. Okay. So basically, E is standard auto attack, but also right click. So you can see I spam it. 
really nice and pre precise and realistic. That's the thing. This graphic is amazing compared, you know, to the one they have in New World. New World's graphics are so weird, but this this is nice. I really like this. Okay, so basically you can play this in two different modes. You can play it in action mode like this, or you can play it in standard RT, you know, RP, MMO. Or you just hold down, right click, and yeah, you know. But I kind of like this action mode. Very, very smooth. Now hit back. Oh, okay. So Q is like um. Boom. Me being old school with major console background, I'm looking forward to seeing how the f how food to control, how good the controller will support will be. <laughs> no, not food. Yeah, no, I know what you mean. Uh, yeah, because that's one of the requirement from Amazon when they're gonna release this, that it's it has to like um, it has to like release on consoles and PC at the same time. So they're waiting. That's why we are currently waiting. Because they're actually waiting for the console version to be finished. So once the console version is finished, we'll be get we'll be getting that. Hey, Mr. Tech, you're Biarch. Welcome to the stream. Good to see you, man. We're playing a brand new MMO today. We just started. Exactly. It's definitely better that console and PC releases at the same time. It will be a way bigger like. Hold down shift. Noise. I'm a cat boy. I'm a cat cat. It's pretty cool you can like you can shift between weapons. So when I press my half button next to my one, I'm switch switching between my sword and my um, my bow but I can even though I have my sword equipped I can still use my bow abilities without swifting weapon which is super cool that's one of the great things with Final Fantasy being crossplay yep and it's out on Xbox as well right now it has like open beta so everyone can like play it for free on Xbox right now I actually kept the armor I picked in the character creation, didn't I? Yeah, I, I picked that, so the five different costumes I could pick between. I actually... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I kept the one that looks like a... Yeah, like a temple. Temple... Crusader, you know, like a crusader thing. At least you picked the one you you liked, which is good. Yeah, yeah, hundred yeah, percent. I mean, look at this. Look at the graphics, bro. This looks fantastic. Just the the room, the lightning, the shadows, my character inside this. <laughs> this this is unreal. Like. Am I playing a single player game? Because it definitely looks like one. Dvalin. Oh, you cannot use spaces. Twitch. You know, we need to self promote the channel, so. Dvalin Twitch. Press F. Sure, I'll help out.
uh, dwell in Twitch. I was looking for you. Lottie has red transport supplies to the North Guard. Could you go with Lottie to take the supplies? She'll need you since it's so dangerous. I'd go myself but for my arm. Give me a hand. So the, basically the game is full in English. Um, the text, every text in the game is in English, except the voices. That's what Amazon is doing right now, translating all the voices. The arm lol, therefore looks like he's faking that arm injury. I was thinking to say, it looks like a bit uh, Captain Jack Sparrow fake. Okay. So we are here right now. The resistance depot. And we have to get out there. Deacon, so it will be full voice acted cutscene story? Yep. Every scene is gonna have voice, every, you know, everything's just gonna have voices. And it is right now in Korea, you know, Korean language. You see this guy keeps talking. And Amazon is currently translating that to English. Alright, are you all ready to see how the open world looks like? Very excited. <laughs> what is this? Beam me up, Scotty. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, it's such a wonderful game. Damn, I mean, I am very happy I just bought a new PC because if I had not bought that new PC, I would probably have to run this game in low specs. This is a brand new PC with a 4070 and my GPU is running right now on 80%. Like if this was my old PC, it would have been burned. Hold on, we're just gonna put up the sounds. 10%. Uh, oh boy, welcome to the stream. Good to see you, man. First chatter from Raid. Oh, good to see you, man. Have you played this game before? I want the music all the way up. Okay. So, um, we got my action bars in the bottom, we got my HP in the top, we got the minimap in the right, and I can see we got a quest. I'm standing there and I need to go there. Cool. So when you run, and hold on, when you... Oh, hey, old Bombi, good to see you, man. You can turn into a cat thing. Yeah, when I just run and press shift, it basically turns me into like a cat. I know if I do like some kind of like jump from high distance, it can turn you into like a bird as well. So we need to talk with Lottie. Hello, Lottie. What brings you here? Uh, I brought the map. Oh, really? I was just going back to get it. Thanks. I should get going. Oh, really? I was just going back to get it. Thanks. I oh, wait, that's the same text. I'll help to deliver the goods. It's true I was about to move to delivery. Did Benny tell you? Honestly, I told him not to worry. Well, it certainly won't hurt to have you come along. Let's go. What exactly are we delivering now? I guess the Arkham portal is opening again. We need to deliver some munitions across Misprion before they invade. We'll want to bring weapons. You never know when you'll get into a fight. Let's head to supplies management first. Connell should have weapon chests ready for us. Oh boy is saying, uh, oh, seven and absolutely love it. Love seeing streamers' reaction. I mean, 
I, I, I know what you mean, because it's like, if you, if you see, if you download, let's say, something like World of Warcraft, you play for the first time, you start at that so starter zone, you know, the starter zones, and nothing about those starter zones are like, wow, this, like, coming out here first, and all, just everything here, it's just, like, amazing. They redid it, like, a good job on first impression. Over the resistance weapon chest, now the war supplies manager. Oh, I guess like... Um... See, so they actually give you every weapon from the start. That's cool. So they give you every weapon for the start. So if you want to like play around with it. Cool. So we can see like I have my sword there. I have my bow. And then if I run and run like anything else, like daggers, crossbow, staff. I don't even know what's like is, is a good thing to run, but for some reason, a bow and a two-hand sword is actually pretty cool. Like, honestly, that's pretty cool. So I think I'm gonna just keep with this. Leave Fortress, Aaron, while uh, following Lottie. Holy moly. Nice. What's that called? Um, with a name tag, even down the sound effects, those little tinging sounds, it just sounds so nice and inviting. It seems to be so polished. It's fantastic. Yeah, it is. I agree. It seems so, like, insanely polished. Damn. Bow in this game is really cool. I wonder when I start playing like PvP with like 100, 200 people if I have to maybe turn down the graphics. Cuphead sound sounds to me as a viewer sounds really good. How does it actually feel in combat from your perspective? It feels very good. It feels like a mix. It, well, I would actually say the combat feels like... Um, it feels like what... Um, kind of like Guild Wars feels like, if you know what I mean. Kind of like, you know, it, it has this action combat which i feel like guild wars also has but still it's tap targeting but it's so smooth because you you basically just attack and then it keeps like using its auto attack just like guild wars 2 and, and then you just fill in with spells so i would say very very smooth
There's got to be another way. There isn't one. Either we use this poly to cross Whispering, or we'd have to go my, by boat. That won't do. Permits is here, so let's check the polys. I'll get this fixed if you'll go to the other assistance members. Someone's hurt over here. Who? It sounds like it's saying happy, happy, happy. Oh, what is this? Who's talking? Oh, okay. That's like a book that I was like talking, but I had no idea what they were saying. Uh, with the name tag, I've been following another streamer from Egypt who's been heavily into this game from Korean release last year. She really knows his stuff too and loves to help others. I believe that when boss battles, bigger PP stuff kicks off, he lower his graphic settings to otherwise there can be a bit lag. But honestly, seeing dozens, probably nearly, if not over 100 players altogether, it just looks incredible. A proper MMO at least, at last. Yeah, I've seen some of that when that guy called Canon been playing, um, which also is sitting in Korea, and he's um, he's in some really big battles. So let's surprise this guy. How did you get here? The lift was destroyed. Some kind of strange power brought me here. Oh, wait a second. Do you have the power star fragment? I've heard whispering. Summer star bearers. It looks like that's true. It reminds me of um, Thomas Edison. Is that the guy who invented light? It looks a bit like him. I want to help protect this island. Thank you. Now please go to Run Terra. Since you have the star fragment, you can glide morph to go down there. I'll go over all operation details later, by the way. Have we met before? Sorry, forget it. Gotta stay focused. Hey Ben GT9. Welcome to stream. Good to see you, man. What GPU you have? Is it 2060 or you upgrade it because the game looks nice? Oh, I forgot to upgrade the, the spec. Thanks for reminding me, by the way. Uh, I just got a new PC, like literally just got a new PC and I have a 4070 now. Yeah, good to remember the, with the name tag. 4070. And with this brand new GPU, my GPU is running on 80%, like, you know, 8-0. So if I had my 2060, I would probably have to play like in low settings.
Benked9 just followed. Thank you so much for the follow, uh, Benji T9. Appreciate it, man. Uh. Uh, uh, am I doing something wrong? Use move to descend to torrent. I'm sorry if this has been asked before, but is there any release date for West yet? No, not yet, man. Sadly, we have no release date of this game. We know we have nothing at, at the moment. Just to tra transform into a bird? The thing is, it, it hasn't... I know how to transform into a tiger, but it hasn't told me how to transform into a bird. Welcome, even, and you'll get used to my time mistakes. Oh, Benji, thanks. I'm building a PC for my brother, and he's a huge fan of the Sirius lineage. So, picking GPU now from Super Sirius. Oh. Leave a fade time. Jump off and double tap spacebar. Thank you so much for that. Speed up. The set. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, don't. Don't press that. Okay, that's an interesting flight mechanics. Thank you for that, oh boy. So basically, I can just fly slow, fly fast, descend, move A, move right. Oh, you can even fly up. Nice. Sky VD, press space again after jumping. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, oh boy, he just told me, but I appreciate the, the tip, man. Good to see we have some pros in the chat. Let's teach these orcs a lesson. Fire dust. Okay. I wonder what dust those items are. Combat is super smooth. Throw the fire dust you obtained at the torrent to destroy it. That's what I needed to use it for. He looks a bit angry. Ouch. 
damage. First boss fight, let's go. Yeah, let's go, man. Do I have some kind of like dodge mechanic? So, uh, that's the guy. Yeah, that's the guy. That's why you feel with. I guess this is us. So the reason we got those powers is because that guy died and kind of powers kind of ran into us. Nice the suspense of not knowing if you're supposed to be able to kill him before cutscenes. Yeah. Not seen the start of this game before. Yeah, it's the same for me. It's the first time I ever see the start. Now I see streamers play this game and they always like level plus 20. You know, remember your mana went into a, a frenzy and you blow away that giant old captain. I couldn't believe my eyes who knew that past star fragment was that strong. Really, your arm suddenly started glowing and purple and your axe went flying straight into the giant orc's eye. Your mouth a sense exploded with a big boom. Are you okay though? How's your arm? Let's ask Clay, he wants to talk to you. Oh, he is definitely faking that arm in a sling. Yep, so much. <laughs> Who is it? Oh. We have this thing here, so every time we complete a quest, I can click on this, and I think we get a reward. So, who is it that wants to talk with me? I guess no, none of them. Does anyone know in the chat, if you, if you want to play a healer, what weapons would you have to use? You did good, Valen. Warned, okay. Thank you, Ben. 
Would you run like a spec where you use wand and then also staff? So wand and staff together, or would you run, run wand and bow? How are you? Feeling better now? I feel better. The enemy withdrew after you took the king bird. I'm glad you weren't seriously injured. The enemy with oh yeah. I remember you saved me in the last invasion. Oh right, from that time when we barely escaped from the chapel in one piece. I almost didn't recognize you. But what do we do about that power of yours? At this rate, you may be chased off like before, or even lose your life to mana frenzy. What should be done? Ben is saying, I don't have the game myself at the moment, but Ward Staff was the most common, followed by Dagger and Bow, I think. Wait, so you're saying you can also heal with Dagger and Bow? Or is that more like, you know, just a popular spec? You know, I have friends in Lasla named Martina. She's conducting research on Mawensense. She should be able to help you out. Worn Dagger, Worn Bow. Oh, yeah, because I heard about Worn Bow. Like, the Worn is having the healing abilities, and the Bow is giving you, like, CC, like, ground control. Which actually also sounds pretty cool. Rona Liberty. The game currently. Oh shit, the game currently has 1.5k views. Look at that. How can I recognize the finder? The storage manager in Castle Milky will know where to find her. In fact, no matter the town, the storage manager knows where to find anything. Touch Luna O's head temporarily enhance your glide ability. So it should get you all the way to Castleton. Always to get our friends. <laughs> Awkward uh, waving to each other. NC presents It's a pretty cool intro. I have to give them that. They did a fabulous job in this intro. GJ KM senior executive executive producer. Moon Young Choi, Head of Division. Young Gogan, Producer. Art Director, Art Production Director, Tech Director. This is this is not a very normal thing to do like in um, in in the West if you know what I mean. I have a Played an MMO in the West when they actually introduced the people behind the game. But it's pretty cool, like, they show some pretty cool scenes, and I don't mind seeing the names. 
It's kind of like what movies does anyway. Uh, would you name second thing? I like the morphing abilities right from the start too. None of that waiting to take a mount mission. Yeah, like World of Warcraft, you first have to be level 40 to get the mount. You know, in, in classic retail, it's only 20, but still. I like all the different themes, like undeads, werewolf, orcs. It's a really like fantasy game. I, f I think once this game comes out in Europe, it can blow up. Like Europe and US, the West, basically the West. I think this game can be big. and liberty. I guess this is some kind of like thing where you can pay maybe and get something. Imagine the server queue on day one. Yeah, this, this is gonna blow up like that's kind of what I that's kind of when I you know I have an evil plan with this game you know that's why I like downloaded it because I kind of want to make like videos about it and stream it so when it actually comes out I already have like tons of content for it. Oh I can choose like between uh, different headgear. They all have the same stats so it's basically just different designs. Magic hat, leather hat, combat hat. I like that one. So can we actually equip that hat? Look at that. Fantastic. It had melee and ranged attack differences on the different hats I noticed. Oh, it had. Because this one had melee defense and ranged defense. Range and hit 10. Oh yeah, I didn't see that. Oh, okay, so I actually picked a helmet which is like better for like range it and oh, okay, so I actually picked the wrong one. But that's probably fine. It's the first gear. Oh god, and the chat is just spammed by gold sellers. Like insanely spammed by gold sellers. I see what Amazon is. You know, Amazon has uh, like made a statement kind of unofficial um, that they're waiting to release the game in the West till they actually fix the bot issue and um yeah if you could see the chat behind my webcam there's a lot of gold selling which is a big problem so we're just gonna change my um key bindings because i want i want to have auto run on my mouse Auto run, auto run. Uh, move forward, move backward, move constantly. There we go. Move constantly. Yeah, there we go. Now I can just press on my mouse. Yeah, no worries. Just noticed as you were clicking around. Yeah, I, I really tried to see like the deep differences, but I just couldn't see it. So what is all these red things? We have this one here. Current Shadow, Gigantrid. It leaves after set duration. We got a lot of other like stuff going on. This is probably like events that is going on right now where you can like join in. You can see like this is probably like a big battle right now, but it says it's level 46 to 49, so 
We're probably going to skip that. Chicken? Oh, they have some kind of like chicken system. Okay. Cool. Some of the bot groups are bongos, but then I've seen streamers aggro a mob, then bring their bit of group and take them down for them. Bot groups, not knit group, lol. Ah, oh, my fat fingers. <laughs> knit groups. Yeah, I have seen those like big groups that just like um, keep auto farming. So why is it glowing up here? Oh, okay, so that's all the like the items I got. I guess you can like drop them down. Oh yeah, down there. Cool. Codex. Collection. Confirm. Okay, so this is like the main campaigns. This is like the main campaigns. We are now on the next main where it says Ask Storage Manager Melky in Liberus Plaza. Okay. And there he is. Do you know Martine? I have no idea who you're talking about. I don't know any brothers by that name. If you don't have anything to store, bust off. Clay sent me. What? You know Clay? I still can't tell you though. Try visiting the priestess. So, we can storage items at him. Like the other weapons, for example. We have like 130 inventory spot, like space. I think we can wait with storing. So what is that? That's like a fast travel point. Raslan's Yongju Hopsu is the king of the king of Lupius. He was a king of the king of Akium, but he was a king of the king of Akium. 하지만 캡틴 다빈치가 이끄는 신성 기사단의 도움으로 라슬란은 다시 해방되었고 이곳 캐슬러 마을에서 라슬란 저항군이 창설되었다. I think this is kind of like the Vistas, you know the Vistas from um, from Guild Wars where you get like a fly view and maybe some story. Was that a purple item to pick up behind the wall near the goblin? Oh, you're right. Your eyes are really good at spotting things. Nice. We've got actually a few here. There's also another one over here. Oh, look at these bots. Like, why is there not just a... Uh, I mean, they just have to put in like a guild ma game master and they could just like ban, 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 ban. Uh, no, uh. So is that a waypoint or what is this? This is just a statue. Oh, that's the braces. So I think we unlocked. Yeah, okay, it was a waypoint. So we can move to it cool and then we can unlock all the waypoints once we actually visit them cool 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 let me explain the situation so if you die this is also the place where you can get back your xp so when you die in this game you lose a bit of your xp and then you can buy it back here and it seems like you have free daily free restoring. So three times every day you can get your XP back for free. 
Let me explain the situation. I see. Please wait a moment. I sense no intentions from you. The power of the gods has confirmed the truth of your words. Of course, however, she is currently in danger and does under protection of the people of this village. You will need to follow some protocols. To meet her, you're going to need a password. Ask the sundry merchant for the first half of the phrase and skills. Researcher for the second half. If you mention that you're seeking red flower, you will receive the answer you need. Okay. Give me your password. I'm looking for a red flower. And then we have to go and get the other part. Like, look at this city. It's a nice place. I can I can really see myself just hanging out in these cities, chatting with people, you know, just doing social stuff. Standing here. I mean, I'm going to create a guild for this game once it comes to West. Um, nice chill song in the background too. Yeah, I think it was, it was a lady down there singing. And now someone is playing music. But just look at this, like, I mean, look at this, all this. this the merchants, the people who stands around. It is so nice. Is there actually like a guild system already? Can I create my own guild for fun? It feels alive. It, it definitely does. Morph. So this is... Glide. Oh, so you have like different glide forms. Swim. Oh god. Oh, I want this. I want to be a turtle. Oh, yes. Oh, this one is cool. That's so cute. Yeah, it is. <laughs> An eagle. Oh, you can become like a little. Oh, my God. No way. Oh, okay, so when I'm when I'm in my tiger form, I actually have three to pick between. I had a shadow for Puma, a wild skull, and a saber tiger. So I get I'm I'm a wolf guy, like I love wolves. So I'm gonna I'm gonna select the wolf. Oh that's so cool. A wolf with armor. Oh my god. Like a big sable tiger. What is this? What the hell is this? Wolf looks good? Yeah, 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 100%. I want to be a chicken, man. Bright, proud tiger. Oh god, no. No, you can be unicorn rabbit. Oh god. This is cool. Yeah, I need this one. This is my main. It's gonna be my main. <laughs> Shokobu from Final Fantasy? Yep. If Deacon was here, he would be flipping. He would be, but he's not here. But if he was, he would be flipping, man. The Chukobu? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it is the one. Look at that. That is the Chukobu from uh, Final Fantasy. Hey Saga, good to see you all the first descendant. How are you playing from Liberty? I just playing on a Korean server. You know, download the VPN called Exit Lag, buy an account on G2G. There you go. That's it. It requires some work. It does. It really requires some work, but So then you can level up the different Oh my god, it even has like some special, like various... 
Oh, so it's some kind of like morph you can turn into, but I think like it's a, uh, um, it's just like it doesn't do anything. It's just more like a, it's morph you can get in the game that does nothing, but it's more like just fun costumes. I want those. So now if I, yeah, now, oh, I guess it changes to my hair color. So because I have red hair, it turns into a red wolf. That's interesting. Disguises. So you're saying that we don't, the thing we just looked at was more like a yeah, disguises, costumes, disguises. Day two. How did it just went from day one to day two? Maybe it uh, just became like the next day in Korea. Never die, Uwu. Welcome to the stream, man. Good to see your first time chatter. I love this game and how massive it is. I reached level 50 and enjoy it so much. Just waiting for Amazon to say something. Yeah. I heard some rumors about some articles coming out in Korea about Amazon is waiting for them to finish the console version because they want to release console and PC at the same time. And also they want the developers to fix the bot issues first before they release it. And also I heard something that it's not going to be free to play in the West, but it's actually going to be like something you need to buy to make sure that there's no bots. And hey, A on TikTok, I don't know if you're still here. I first saw your message now, but this game is called Throne and Liberty. It's a brand new MMORPG. So never die, Uvu. If you have any tips for me, feel free to shoot. I'm looking for a red flower. So the priest sent you the second half of the password is Whispers. If you want to meet Martine, head to the castles on infirmary on the north side of the town. The doors will be locked, but just speak the password and you'll be allowed to enter. Okay. Add it to your Steam wishlist. Oh yeah, sorry, you cannot... Um link but it's a good point Ronan and liberty yeah no, no worries so here's the link yeah so if anyone see, see looks this likes this game definitely add it to your to your wish list as uh with the name tag is saying never die Ubu, probably true very important that ncsoft fix this bot issue first I hope it it's is a pay to play game. Yeah, hundred percent. Like uh, I heard some rumors that it's gonna be costing like fifty bucks or something like that. That would definitely make it way harder for all the bot makers out there to to play the game because you know they would have to like um, uh, like keep buying the accounts, which is gonna be very expensive. And a on the TikTok. Um, so, so basically it's called Throne and Liberty. It's a new MMORPG. It's only out right now in Korea, but because I play with a VPN, I'm able to play the game. But by saying when you start picking green gear, make sure you take mana region helps a lot early game. Oh, okay. I will remember that. Even when running two hand sword, you also need mana for that. Never die, Uvu. First advice, don't waste your skill books. Very important. Skill books. I don't think I've gotten any of those. Oh, what is this? Interesting. So this is like skills I can get. Nice. I kind of want to see what skills the want is giving you. Uh, applies in people, deals damage over time. Uh, da, da, da. Deals base damage, deals damage. Da, 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 da. Restore free target health. 
Okay, yeah, that is seven. Oh, nice. Okay, so it's basically a Harry Potter healer. Aha. Harry, you are a wizard. <laughs> you are a wizard, Harry. Yeah, I choose the same as Greatsword Dagger. So you won't like recommend like running bow? Because I've heard a lot of people saying Greatsword Dagger is like so good. I just feel like, you know, having a bow. Having a bow, a greatsword is so cool. Oh, we have the same hair. Never die, if you want to be full DPS and one shot people, greatsword and daggers, best or expo and daggers. Okay, so greatsword and daggers or crossbow and daggers. I see. What is the bow good for? Like the normal bow? Is it is it like any good? Is it more like a support spec? I wonder why. I wonder how. I wonder how. Oops. Starting to watch my own stream, huh? Best range, longbow and daggers, very strong DPS too. Best range, longbow and daggers, very strong. Okay, I'm gonna try the gi, the great sword and daggers then. Right, so we have to catch some ingredients for her. Some, for some kind of like potion we're about to create for her. Or help with her. I don't understand you. You want to be mortal sword and great sword? Sword and wand. You want to be immortal sword and great sword or sword and wand? What is a mortal sword? Is that like a... Like a paladin? That would be insane. Like, a, I would love like a paladin build. Like, that would be my favorite build ever. Like, you know, something that could like... Like a paladin build would be so cool. What would, what would I need for that? Can I be like a paladin with a two-hand sword? Wand and sword. Oh, of course. So you can like throw healing abilities at the same time having a two-hand sword on you. Oh, do you talk like normal sword, like in one hand and shield? Because I would love... Oh, I see. So like wand... A normal sword like this. And and it wouldn't work like it wouldn't work with like great sword and wand. You don't deal damage, but you can ease the tango with ten people. Oh, so 
So where do we have to go? Speak with Aina. Oh, okay. Yeah, just here. But be careful though, as if you're solo, you will struggle during events and will be bullied by others at events. As if you're solo, you will struggle during events because of low damage as Paladin. I see. Slug Siri. Farvel. Hey, it's every time I say... Every time I say, you know, the word, it, um... Just just subscribed for two months. Whoop oh. whoop. Oh my put juice. Thank you so much for the sub, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. Two months subbing. I appreciate it, man. Welcome to the stream. We are playing a brand new MMORPG. And I'm loving it so far. Uh because of the low damage. In this game all depends on what your play style. If you have always which I will say go for it. Interesting. So in this game here, you can really like, you know, you can really like mix and play around with like different play styles. I like that. So I can pick between this one here, which is basically a parry or a chaotic shield. It's the BDO 2.0. See, it could remind of BDO, I agree, um, but I better like the combat in this one because it's not like combo based, like as it is in Black Desert Online. It's more just like a standard tap targeting combat. Activate the waypoint. I have already activated. Activate the waypoint of the golden rye. When I have to run to that location over there, I need to run manually over there, right? There's like no buttons I can click on and it just runs over there. They removed the auto parving, didn't they? So I, I have to move manually over there. But I pop my uh, purchase. What are you actually playing recently? I mean, what is everyone playing recently? I used to play like World of Warcraft, but um, I got a bit bored of it. I'm waiting for season two coming in season discovery. And now I'm playing this. Oh, this is interesting. When I eventually get on this, I will be investigating every nook and cranny. Same. Same, same, same. I'm probably gonna like take two, three days off for like vacation and just live stream all three days. Just be living in this game. You have acquired. You have acquired new stat points. Distribute these points to the side abilities. And we got more quests now. Oh, there he is. 
So now we got the mission over there. Yeah, Shh. I don't understand you. Collect page from collection codex, golden rye pastures. Oh, I see. You can upgrade equipment by using growth stones on the right of the right type and rank the level of equipment. All right, so you can like um, upgrade your weapons. Oh yeah, I see. There's like a space there for like a, a little stone. Hey, Ramberg, welcome back. So how do we like it? It's good. It's good. It's really good. It is really good. It's that point. Yeah, right. It's for it's for po a potion. Oh, I see. But yeah, it's it's really good. It's a good game. So polished, so like yeah. I think this this is gonna be a big success once it once it gets to like um Europe and US, like uh, the West. I'm so happy to hear or more on oil than a potion. I see. It's a tin, exactly. It's a tin. So what stats do I need? Serve the basis for the body, provide strong defense in addition to increasing max health, health region, max damage, and min damage. Serves a base of proficiency, increase quickness, critical attacks in addition to evasion and max damage. Serves the basis as the basis of the mind, increasing max mana, mana region, effects cooldown, abilities, and max damage. Serves as the basis ends heightened awareness. Awareness during battle, increase occurrence of attacks, CC effects, enhanced time boost, abilities, and increase max damage and min. I see. Can I reset these points and how expensive is it? Like, let's say I want to go strength. Apply. Zero reset stats. I guess I can get these hours glasses and then reset it, whatever I like, I want. I want to try kill something. It's not super expensive. Yeah, exactly. Okay, cool. Let's test this bad boy. Oh. Look at that. Great sword and throwing spells. Whenever I need, just pop a little self heal. I love it. Yeah, thanks for the paladin tip. That's pretty cool. What are my abilities actually doing? Uh, applies carrier steals damage over time. Okay, deals. Okay, so this is more like a curse damage over time. Like here. And then it deals 8, 8. Eight. And then this one is more like an explosion. And then I have a pretty strong self heal. Hey Nick, good to see you man, welcome to the stream. Pile of straw. Hey, I missed you. I hope you're doing at least two steps above average. What? <laughs> well, I miss you, man. I miss you as well. It's been so long time since we saw each other. I hope you're doing at least two steps above average. I am, of course. I'm a, I'm a min max. Why is it having that icon over the head? Is it because I can heal him? Huh. Come blade. Come blade. A quiet shapeshift scarab. No way. Oh, that's so fun. Okay. 
Can I attack in it? No, it goes out of it. Uh, with your name tag saying, oh, you can swap quickly between three quick slots settings. Two by, by the look of that. Yeah, that, that's the thing. You don't have to switch your weapons. For example, you can see I have now my two hand weapons spells down and I have my uh, wand spells. So I can just press six and it uses my healing. I can use my five and it uses my wand ability and switches directly back to my weapon. So it's not like, you know, the shitty combat that you have in Elder Scrolls Online where you have to like switch weapon, 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 weapon. You know, in that game, you just like switch weapon every second. It's, it's not like that at all. In that case, I hope you're doing well. Yeah, man, I'm doing I'm doing great, man. Hope you're doing well, okay as well. But looking at it, you can have two different set slots too. Uh, yeah, but yeah, but I'm not sure if you can like switch between them in combat. It seems like it's more like you know for different situations. So, I don't think we can like switch between these in combat. Ah, uh, wait, it actually says I can. No, not in combat. Okay, so yeah. Okay. No, it just said it. There was a key binding for it. Hold on, let me see what's the key binding is. Uh, settings. Doesn't have any. Yeah, I, I can't find any like a uh, key binding. This set cannot be changed while active skills are in cooldown state. Yeah, so whenever you have like anything on cooldown, you cannot change them. It's only when you have nothing on cooldown. Interesting. The passive is settled. We are ta talking about the passes on the right side. No, 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 no. We're talking about the, this quick slot here. So you have like different slots where you can have like different abilities in, in different orders. But it seems like it says here that you cannot change while anything else. So you can change even in combat, but you can only change when nothing is on cooldown. Yeah, it makes sense. So you just can't like change between all of them all the time. Oh, we completed that bonus quest. Is that another player? Can we already like join? Claim reward. Claim reward. Purchase pass. Some kind of like battle boss. I use it for great sword bow and then the two two is great sword dagger. I'm gonna guild one second. Let me see if I can invite for a bag. No worries. Is my game gonna crash now? Was it not a good idea to go in here? I don't think it was a good idea to go in here. Gabby D, thank you so much for the follow, man. I appreciate it on TikTok. Okay, so it seems like I have to crash the game. That is new. Well, at least you found out earlier in the game rather than later, I guess. <laughs> yep. Don't go into this page here. 
I have to go into my um, task manager and crash it. Crash. Crash. Start game. And and we know Amazon for sure. Like once this game comes out, it's gonna have some kind of like drops by watching the game. You know, they always have that Amazon for new games because you know they own Twitch, so so they can do whatever they want. This game is not intended for anyone under the age of 19. <laughs> Come on. You can play for only but after you join the security service. This is a bad thing. The guild is full, let's find a new one we can both join. For sure. This future will prevent unverified accounts to access the game to ensure a safer game environment variant. To use the courtesy service, you may enter your phone number and then register your device. But I've already done that like a hundred times. Saberfall, rib account? Uh, um, is my account already dead? Welcome to the stream, by the way. No, it does not open a browser. Shouldn't it be? Does it open a browser? Nope. Let's try open the account. So we got Dwell and Twitch there, level two. It says here that my account is verified. Let's try close the bra. We, we're gonna try close the launcher. There we go. Closing everything. Closing exit lag. Opening exit lag. Let's restart. We're just gonna do very from from the bottom. That would be real trash if uh, my account is already uh like gone. It will work. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Yeah, in a way it's a quick, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I was just getting into the game. I was just getting into the game, man. Let me have some fun before you ban me. Okay, so exit lag, the VPN is running now. Now purple, the launcher for laws, uh, sorry, uh, Throne of Liberty is running. Well, it's trying to run. 
Sebastian's all the plans for pre-launch content. Yeah, like I, I really wanted to like make videos for my YouTube, like small guides about the game before it released. But that's gonna be pretty hard if they don't want to let me play. You remind me of that old meme that doesn't want the dog that after the week with the dog. Yep. That was me, because I remember telling Kaylin and a lot of people like, I'm not going to play this game. It's too uh, too much work. And then look at me now. I'm playing the game. <laughs> I also remember telling Ramberg like, nope, yeah, we're going to play this game. I'm going to I'm going to wait till it releases and look at me now. Yeah, I know. I've been lurking here since the start, just been doing something in the kitchen. That's why I didn't chat. No worries, man. I appreciate the the, the lurk view. It's always good with some additional views. Okay, the game is starting now. Fingers crossed that it actually will work. Sorry for all those windows pop out sound. It's the VPN. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> I was getting nervous there, man. I was getting so nervous. Ooh, yes, 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 we are in, we are in. And now with the name tag, yay. You still didn't get the plugin for apps as single audio source. I recommend you use to. I don't like it because when I do it, the sound is lower than normal sound. I guess it's why it says like a beta outside it. So it's, the sound is like very low compared to um, just normal. I don't know why. So, um, what am I looking for? Where's the guild? Guild, 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 guild. Can be used after starting appendix, a mutually beneficial meeting. Okay, so I, it's first for my next main campaign. Yeah, so I'm not able to do guilds yet. You can boost it with filters, but yeah, gotcha. Outside of listening to copyright music, which you don't do in Windows sounds, it's not that useful. That's the thing, like, I always just play games and listen to my own music, so... What do you need? So where is the herbalist? Uh, do you need something from the master? I am seeking rancid powder. Rancid powder? Well, I know how to make it, but... No, no, please forget what I just said. I'm afraid that he's not available at the moment. Please come back later. I can't. I haven't received Master's approval yet. What if I just tell you the ingredients you need, and you can gather them and find yourself? Level up. Give me that strength. Oh, did I just get passive abilities? Noise. Max health plus 420. When a weakened target dies, max damage plus 12 for 9 seconds. Nice. I like this paladin build. I'm a freaking paladin. Who are you? CIXG. Are you in the chat right now? Are you following me? Are you stream sniping me? Um, Saberfool, did you grab your account from G2G? I did, yeah. I did. I paid 62 Danish kroners, which I guess is like 5 euros or something like that. And I it allowed me to change my email, password, phone number so everything is on my account and nothing to do again with you know the original account
So I cry. Uh, do you know who the guy was? I uh, if you want the link, I can give you it. Um, he had like a five out of five rating, and had like sixty seven accounts on on stock. Very professional. Uh, you just have to when you order, you have to wait, and um, then the person will send you everything you need in a message directly to you. It said like. This is your password, this is your email. And then it was like, this is the link to change your email. This is the link to change your password. This is the link to change your phone number. You know, very professional. This is the guy. He has sold, he, she has sold 1,398 accounts. I have nothing to do with them. I don't have any affiliate deal with them. You know, so if something bad happens <laughs> it's not on me but it was very easy to buy from them they have a link you know when you change the e phone number it's going to send a phone number to the phone number they created so they're going to give you a link to like some kind of like api call so when you click on that link it will show the, the sms in a web browser very 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 cool uh, no, I don't think so, because it was so long up in our history. Uh, so I just like I went just in and found the one that has most sold and best rating. Oh, you did? Okay, it was the same. Okay, what's the chance of that? Because I didn't uh, actually know when, which one you did. Regarding your message to me on Discord, I have changed my phone number, email, everything. So it's it's one hundred percent my account now. I saw someone opening some kind of like window where it kept attacking the monsters automatically. You know, some kind of like grind window where they just, you know, clicked find these monsters and blah, blah, blah. Is that something I have unlocked yet? Not that I don't want like all to play, but it still look very efficient. And I would name tag. But same person. And they have 100% positive rating too, which is impressive. Yeah, yeah, 100%. I think they really like, they really, if there's any problems, they will help you. Ah, there we have him. Eric Morningwood. That's Rainberg in the chat. Don't I have like emotes? You look pretty awesome. Char character card. Add as friend. Follow. Cool. I've added you as friend. And you're in a guild called the Black Rose. Yeah, I was super happy with them as well. Super service. I had some, I had some issues, and they helped. Nice. Morningwood. Yeah, yeah. He he knows what he's doing with that name. I'm just gonna try for a moment to run the dagger build that everyone says is the super damage damage build. Then run the great sword. Then the passive, which gives 
Okay, move speed. I love Morningwood. The family name, of course. Of course. Damn. That's some pretty powerful weapons. Add weekend poison effects. Uh, deal space damage plus one. Move to the other side of the target. Deal 200 base damage. Alright, I see. I can definitely see how it can really like burst down enemies in no time. But I just love the fact that, you know, I can be like a paladin. The staff doesn't have any healing spells, does it? No, that's purely damage. Purely damage. Uh... Oh, you're gonna have more passives now. Which I haven't. Need some sleep. Super happy to see you in the game with a smile. See you all. Yeah, man, Rainbow. I'm so far loving this game. But I'll see you, man. We we definitely gonna try when we get later. When I unlock dungeons and stuff like that, we gonna we have to try it. I'm sure we're gonna be unlocking dungeons like early game as well. But sleep well, man. See you around. Speak with Mandrake Farmstead Manager Ned at Mandrake Farmstead in Golden Rye Pastures. Alright. Hell Steppers, welcome to the stream. When will the game come to the US? Yeah, it is um it's a good question. I wish I could answer you, because I really want the game to come to Europe and US, but sadly at the moment we don't know. There has been some rumors, some articles released in uh, Korea recently that Amazon is waiting for the game to be finished, developed on consoles because they want to release the game on console and PC at the same time. So, yeah. It would be nice if Amazon just would say something about when maybe, but they don't want to say anything. But uh, welcome to the stream. And console launch, according to some Korean articles, is supposed to come late. Q2 2024. Yeah, and if it's, if that's right, I guess so if end of year, early 2025 would be fine until they rush it. Probably by the time they figure out how to implement consoles into the new world. Yeah, you know, it, it, it could be when it's ready for console, it comes out ASAP to Europe, maybe in Q2 2024. I mean, who knows? Um, but I also know that they have said to the developers they want to fix the bot issues, you know, all the bots. So, we'll see. I hope it comes out soon, but um, we have to see. Have they said anything about bringing New World to consoles? I haven't heard anything about that. Oh, control support. Okay, okay. Yeah, because you can play near world with controller right now, but you know you need to use those Steam profiles, and it's not it's not good. It works. I have a video about how to do it. Um, it's good, but it's not the best. But yeah, I'm shocked that near world doesn't have control support. It's like the most simple combat. You know, not many spells. Like, why is it not a thing already?
Sebastian. So, you know, I, I'm not really into like, you know, playing Black Desert Online because of the combat system is a bit too advanced for me. But this feels like something I can definitely get into because it's kind of, the game reminds me of Black Desert Online, but you know, just without the very complex combat. Which I, you know, I'm a casual man. Party recruitment. Yeah, it's just tap target. Exactly, it's just tap target. You can also play this action combat, but it's basically just tap target also. Oh, you get XP from actually mining. Nice. And video has a really good combat once you invest into learning it, but because of all the Asian bloodwound pop-ups, many people have no will to test and it can't I can't play them. Yeah, it's like I've just never really played games with that kind of combat and it's it was just a bit overwhelming for me. Level. So this was giving me increased max health, health regen, max damage, and min damage. Nice. I really like tangy the strength stat. Uh, hey Apex, good to see you man, long time no see. Which server did you pick? I picked the uh, stone... stone... Uh, stone guard. Uh, Sebastian, uh, from Liberty for now just looks like tap target wow done by Asian company and less bold than the video. Fighter games players tend to cater to BDO and you said that you always sucked at local PS2 games. Tekken sessions? Oh yeah. I have never been a good Tekken guy. Join, our, join us in Asota, bro. We have a massive alliance. Is it like the one that also Canon he's a part of? Ah, so you're playing on Cannon's Alliance. Yeah, me me and Rainberg, we were thinking about playing on that soil, but he had picked this one here, so I just picked it also to play with him. And again, you know, I'm for me it doesn't really matter like uh to play in Cannon's Lions. What level what level are you the Apex? Good this game doesn't have bots, huh? <laughs> no virus man, you'll enjoy the game just as much. Yeah, it's a nice game. It's full of bots, yeah. They just have to, when they release it in Europe and US, they just have to like, um, uh, they just have to like, um, what I'm trying to say, you know, make it pay to play, you know, basically make it cost $50, and then you won't see that many bots. L Stepper, I want to make a Staff Dagger build in this game. Ah, huh. Staff Dagger. Sounds interesting. Like you know, you know, you both have like elemental attacks, but you also have like close combat with the teleportation and stuff like that. Apex, I'm level fifty. One staff healer main. Ah, one star. Dagger synergize with everything, basically. I see. I'm just trying out this Paladin build here where you run Greatsword, like, you know, for damage. And then you just have to warn for, like, healing abilities and stuff like that. It might be really bad, but I'm enjoying it at, at the moment. You 
we can duel our players here. Healers are always S tier in MMOs. You can't really go wrong, just some things synergize better than others. Play what you like. Good to know, man. And again, you know, I'm early level, I'm just playing around, having fun. Wait until mana calming potion is brewed. Wait, so I have to stand in there and wait for them to make the potion. Do I have like to wait for something? Okay, I just have to wait. So, A backs, could I theoretically either like tank with this build, like you know, great sword and wand, or could I heal be like a healer with wand and great sword, or would that not be efficient for any of the of the roles? Exit Castleton's Infirmary. Martinega Mandrozen Mario Pook to Tinjangje Hukban, King Tangetta. Tinjangje Mashtamat. Grow the normal great weapon to level three. I don't even know to, how to grow my weapon. Speak with Mina below Spiral Cliff in Windhill Shoal. What about this one here? Grow the normal grade weapons level 3. Now we have to go all the way down there. We could probably like fast travel over there. That is pretty impressive that I could just like fast travel from there to here without even a loading screen. Uh, where's this? Okay, let's do this quest. Defeat 20 creatures in a windhill shoals to collect contained creatures basement. It's the same speed I think anywhere you are TB so impressive. Wow, oh, pretty cool. <clears throat> so Apex. Uh, can you actually hear me, or do you have like an ad right now? Because it says right now there's an ad running. I can hear you. Okay, cool. Uh, so basically, when you do missions like this, do you have to manually around and kill them? Or does it have any kind of like autoplay where you can just click and it completes the quest for you? Or do you have to like manually go around? I 
I don't usually get acid grease. I see. They took all the farm out. There was never an auto quest play in this game. People just all reacted as usual. I see. So where is this quest? Okay, that's over there. It was very rudimentary, only useful for farming lithographs stuff and maybe some other quests but i took it out okay Hey DJ, welcome to the YouTube stream. Uh, any any NA news on TL? Sadly not, man. Sadly not. We're still waiting for them to have a release date for Europe and NA, basically the West. Uh, but there's some rumors that Amazon is waiting for the console version to be finished, and there's some rumors that the console version will be ready in Q2. Uh, you know, the first half of the year, Q2. And then maybe we're going to get the game there, or maybe it has to be delayed a bit. But dreams could be that it would be coming out in Q2, but um, we don't know for, you, for sure yet. So I'm just playing on Korea servers at the moment. I couldn't resist anymore, I, I had to try it. I agree on the buy to play comment, by the way. It would be somehow limited, if bots of free to play will be insane and Amazon won't be able to stop them. It'll be worse than Lost Ark, exactly. Make the game cost 50 bucks, 40 bucks, something. It would help so much getting rid of all those bots. And I saw them, I saw in a Korea article that they already are talking about it themselves, so it's probably gonna happen. Uh oh. Sorry. <laughs> NCSoft is banning them weekly in Korea. They put the names on their news notices. Oh, really? Adriana 
Examining the wrought iron chest by climbing up to the second floor. Yeah, this section they post in weeks at all. Oh, but it's free to play, so the new ones are ready. Yeah, that's the thing. Nothing special here. Touch the golden flower on the book cover. There's nothing special here. Touch the golden flower on the book cover. Ah. There we go. Fun mechanic. This looks like she spent a lot of time in the chair. What decided she come in the end? Witness events in the past. Hi, Blackout. On YouTube. Hello, I am moving to Twitch. All right. There she is. Hello, I have arrived on Twitch. Hello, Blackout. Your arrival has been expected. How's the game? It's good. It's, it's good. I, I think this can be really good. Like really good. Damn. Damn. Alright. Nice art style for the storytelling. Yeah, that's it's cool with those small cinematics they do. They both have these cinematics like this, but they also have them. Um, uh, yeah, Blizzard actually has same animations sometimes, uh, especially for Battle for Azeroth, that expansion. <clears throat> but they also have like 3D like animations. They have like different style of animations they do. <clears throat> Before I go back, I need to speak with someone. Talk to Winhill Shaw's researcher at Spirit. He's on the other side of this. But well, Blackout, the game is beautiful. Like the combat is nice. It's it's a really cool game. Oh, we can get a green weapon now. Great sword. Did I get the great sword then? I did. So right now my sword looks like this from Lord of the Rings the orcs could be using. But now I got a claymore. 
That's what we like. Abang saying it's a PvP game. It doesn't look like it, but everything revolves around your guild and PvP. Not a problem with me. Needs to be bigger for sure. Like I could, I could use a bigger sword. Uh, Apex, the, the thing you know, I saw some people doing, like you know, with the um, the guilds, you know, where they have like guild dungeons. So you basically group up your guild, and then you go to your guild hall and do these guild dungeons with the guild bosses. Looks pretty cool. And I'm going to just say anyone for an... Yeah, exactly. It's it's really cool. Uh, check your map. Acquire Magical Regent. Oh, yeah. That... Glide, Morph and Sprayed Unified Containment the east side okay how do i do that glide move and spray on anything because okay i'm a bird descent The feet large stone crab that are wet from rain of sea water. Look at that. I'm a little cute otter. We'll be doing the castle defense siege on February 3rd, midday Europe time. It's at around 12. Is there like a limit on how many can join or is it um? What is the rules about that? Is it like max 50 people or can it like there be 100? The whole cell will be there. Oh, so it's nothing to do with the guild. It's basically just um, something everyone can do. Any guild can contest it, I believe. Not sure. We'll know more this week. Okay, cool. Well, if you get some information, let me know. I'll tell um, Reinberg that you also play, because he's he asked me if I knew any of an, or anyone else playing the game. Um, I'll let him know that you also play and cannot server. We might switch over to that one, maybe. There we go. The feet large stone crab that are wet from rain or sea water. But that's what I'm doing. Absolutely, man. How come game is in English? I thought this was to straight to, to Korea. So when they made this game in Korea, they made it both in English and, you know, Korean language. So theoretically, it's already ready to ship to Europe and US. It just doesn't have any uh, English sound. That's what Amazon is doing right now, translating. 
Apex, I'm a lineage, uh, lineage to Viseron. This game is very much like that, no layer C to see. Yeah, I heard this game was literally supposed to be lineage free, but they renamed it. So I'm sure like if you're a lineage player, you, you love this game. People data mine the English voiceovers. Oh really? BH, I like the Korean voice lines. I agree, it sounds nice. Nothing wrong with that. What the hell was this? I don't understand this. It keeps telling me. Defeat large stone scale crap. That is what I'm doing. It's most likely the console thing you mentioned, should I tell you? Well, yes, please. What am I missing? Do I have to like read the whole thing? Okay. Defeat large stone at the wet from rain or sea water. While you search treasure hidden in the ship right on the stone, and they look like normal when you get close, you'll find those. So I need to find some who has some kind of like wet effects on them. There's a state to the figure. Just kind of it. Oh. Oh, like how? How could you already? Figure that out, Blackout. Am I really that dumb? <laughs> so what? <laughs> what is wet? <laughs> there we go. Done with all the side quests. Didn't get it either for the first time. Yeah, it's like that. Like, what was the point of that? What was the point of that? Crap plus water equal also wet. How does my inventory look like? What is this? A weapon growth material used for uncommon weapon enchants. Oh, so I can level up my weapon. Should I just save these for like better weapons or should I upgrade my weapons now? Players are affected by those two, I see. Should I waste this now or should I kind of like save it? I like this. This is really nice. Like upgrade the items. It makes me wonder what is it's trying to teach you as, as and why. I could imagine, you know, something like a uh, Frost spells can freeze you if you're like in the water or something like that. You know, some kind of like elemental effects. I have skill that gives me 600 mana regen when I'm wet and use it. Oh, I see. Kind of, it reminds me of um, Percy Jackson. When he stands in water, he like self heals. Those are trash items. Yeah, let's uh, let's wait with that. Let's keep them. What is this? Too high level. If mob players are wet, you do more damage with lightning spells. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah that, that makes sense. But I wonder what these bots are doing. Like, why do they keep running away from the window? To the window, like, what's the point? They, they are stuck. Oh, okay. Okay, so 30,000 gold for resetting all your stats. Nice.
Have you been streaming this game, Apex? That's cheap at, as fuck at end game, by the way. So it gets like e more expensive the longer you get. Ask about the wolf hunting contest at the Lone Residence. Speak with storage manager Melky. Okay, so we finished this main campaign. This main campaign. Oh, I need this one. Grow the normal great weapons to level 3. I need to complete this quest as well. So I, I need to upgrade a weapon. Uh, is it L? What is my quest? There. I think he means 30k is nothing when you get to endgame. Ah, uh, I see. Hyperinflation. I made about 700k today. And yes, I streamed about 125 hours of this so far. Why am I not following you? I'm just I'm just clicking follow on you now. Because I enjoy like seeing other people, um, streamers play. Um, I think it's because I subscribe to you on YouTube and I really never like thought about you actually are on Twitch. But I just follow you now. So now I, now, now I will see when you get live next time and even get a notification. Grow the, grow the normal great weapons level 3. When it says normal weapon, I guess we can take like my wand. Wand. Level up. It's all good. Thank you, sir. Yeah, no worries, man. No worries. Damn. We need to play Core Punk. I'm all in, I'm all in for that, man. But it's first end of February. There we go. Completed now this one. Uh, okay, so I got uh, got a few questions now. Ask about blah blah blah. Speak with story manager. Blah blah blah. Your guild occupies one or more bonus stones at the end. Did I unlock guilds yet? Nope. I haven't unlocked guilds. Why do does these all look at the same? It kind of looks like a guild armor. Do they have like some kind of like shop where you can like buy um? Base damage, increased melee defense, range defense, max health, health region. Bro, I played like 45 hours of Korpong in those 4 days of the beta. That is way more than me. Like I say, yeah, I hardly got any sleep when playing. Do they have like a skin shop? Um... Where I can buy like insane skins. Special shop, but not much in it at the moment. Yeah, this one is boring. Like, what the hell? Web oh, this is the one everyone is running with. I, I see everyone, like, even Canon is using this one. So if I buy this, can I use it on all weapons, or can I only use it like one time? Because I see every streamer like, yeah, only one... Uh, only one time. So like every time I get a new weapon, I need to buy this again? Oh, so I can like keep applied, like... Do we have some kind of like cosmetic, um, like, is there some kind of like cosmetics, like, like this is the items? Is there like some kind of like costume set? My bad, I was replying to the amount of them available. 
Oh, okay, okay, okay. So you just buy it one time and then you can use it all the time. There's not many cosmetics, is what I meant. Do you know if I buy it, how I, I apply it? Hello, special mirror boutique. Oh, costumes. I see. What the hell is this? You even have colors. Oh, I love this one. This one is nice. So there's no no of the skins I like at the moment. Like all these skins are boring. Um, but weapon appearance. Jeez. But I'm not sure. I think you can apply it to any weapon and move them around. Should explain it there. I don't have any. Didn't spend my money. Money. All right. I see. Can I actually spend money, or does it require that I have like a credit card from another country? Like what would happen if I said I want to buy it? Okay, so I need 600, which is 20,009 of the currencies. Oh, it opens up a browser. Okay, so what is this currency to USD? So they want $21 for that skin. You know what? It's not that important. Like, you know, thanks, but no thanks. It, it was like it opened up a website where you could buy it, so it looked like, you know, fairly straightforward. But yeah, no, I'm not. Uh, I'm not paying that amount of money. Oh, hey, Kaylin. Welcome to the stream. If I'm having fun, I am having fun. It's uh, it's fantastic to play a new MMO. Like this game is so beautiful. The, game, the combat is nice, you know. I'm happy, man. I am truly happy. No, I still don't want to deposit anything at you. I'm very jealous. I think they have fixed the issue, you know, the one you had with your phone numbers, because it seems like everyone can use their phone numbers now. Before you couldn't use any other phone numbers than career numbers, but they did something recently, so now you can use any phone number. But yeah, and okay, Lynn, I've, I've been keep saying to you that I'm not gonna buy it, I'm not gonna do it, and then look at me now. I guess it's like play call point, your character is essentially going to be deleted and you'll have to start over. No. I'm keeping this character. Like, you know, it's going to be on the Korea server forever. Of course, when I go to uh, Europe, I would, you know, have to create a new character. But it's, it's going to stay in Korea because it's not beta, it's the final game. You caved in? I did. I definitely caved in. Hey Voodoo Bones, good to see you man. Kinda reminds me of an updated Rift. Yeah, or you could say a PDO 2.0, Black Desert Online 2.0. So you're going to play in Korea servers forever? No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, so once you know I'm gonna uh, you know, go to Europe, which could be in 6 to 12 months. It doesn't, it, that's fine with me. The problem with betas is that you know I know, for example, with Corpong, in four days my character's gonna get deleted. That's not fun. But I know the final game is first gonna come out in like six to twelve months, so you know. That's okay with me. 
먼저 파라몬더 피안에서 새로 만들 유인제의 재료를 구해야 한다. Save all. So you don't need a Korean phone number. What's the point of buying an account? You have to create the account in Korea with a phone number from Korea. After all that is done, the account is verified. All that shit is done, then you can change the account, the phone number, and email to another. So that's the point. You need to create the account with a Korean phone number and all that nonsense. That's why you have to buy an account. But after you have, yeah, bought it, you can change it. If that makes sense. You're never going to play this char again once it is in Europe. That's true, but it's still first in six to 12 months, which is fine for me, because you know, we never know if we're going to be alive by then. Um, Was that a bit too dark? Uh, Abax, you cannot create one with KRIDSN, but you can change the details after it's made. That's what they're selling. Yeah. So basically, the account you buy on G2G is made with all the right things, and then you can change it to whatever you want. Crazy Banana, welcome to the stream, man. Crazy ba Tuna. I don't know why I thought your name was Banana. How hard is this game? So far, it's not hard. I think it's casual friendly, but I can I can tell you because I'm still only level six. Oh, so we can like. Okay, that's fair. But also, this is the argument I make with you when you're trying to get to play V Rising. Yeah, but you know, Wii Rising is one of those survival games where we play on a server that could literally be deleted tomorrow. You know, I don't like playing on those local hosted servers. You know what I mean? I just, yeah. That's another thing. Could be dead tomorrow. We could be dead tomorrow. That's true. Eredit, what's the level cap? I think it's level 50. I want that as a large scale MMORPG. That would be pretty cool though. I'm pretty sure on its level cap is level 50 irritative. Oh, what is this? So you can like craft gear here. I wonder where I get this. All to leave. So pretty. It, 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 yeah, the game is really beautiful. Open the gear enchanting window to transfer the grown common weapon to uncommon weapons. Transfer. Wait, what? Open the notification window, collect the rewards and craft a side piece uncommon with Rachel. Oh, there we go. I got it now. Cool. So now I can go and craft an item. Okay. I want... Collision Shans. What is Collision Shans? Mana Region. Yep. That's what we want. I heard someone say mana region is good, so we want mana region. Melee hit. Okay, this one is actually doing something good for melee hit and melee evasion. Mm. Mana hit, mana regeneration, or melee. Whatever, let's do that one. Okay. Open the notification window. Select and level to craft it. 
So this is the new helmet we just got. Damn, look at that. Damn, I'm a paladin. Open the notification window to collect the reward and level up the crafted uncommon eye armor. So it wants me to level it up. Cool. And then it wants me to transfer something. Open the key and shiny window to transfer the grown common weapon to uncommon weapon. Oh, it's because it wants me to craft a weapon as well, I guess. Or wants it. Great sword 68. We need to enchant the grey item. Uh, then transfer it to the green one. Enchant, enchant, enchant. What is it, the enchant? Because I already leveled it up. So I, I need to like level up the, this one here. And then, uh, I see. Okay, so this is kind of like Law Star, where if you have like already upgraded a lot of bad gear, and you get new gear, you can put the bad gear into your new gear. I see. That makes sense. But it doesn't break. Oh god, thank you for that. We don't want that from Black Desert Online where it breaks your gear. That's smart. So basically I can uh, I can do something smart. I can take this one here. Oh, I thought you told me that it breaks it in Black Desert. And then transfer. Hehe, <laughs> very smart. Enter the shipwreck near Crusade. You can only transform transfer into an item once it's though. Oh, okay, so I'm not able to get on any other helmets and upgrade them and transfer them. It's only like one time. So the lower tier item should be max level enchant for efficiency. Oh, I see. Okay, makes sense. Mm, good. Where's my quest? It's over there, so I should fast travel to here. Now I go from level 1 to 14, then redo, trio, Ted, Pen. If you fail the 107% chance from Ted to Pen, it will go backwards to tree. Okay. Okay, because I think when you told me it, I believed it was... Like, it sounded for me as you said, uh, basically it deletes the entire item, and I was like... What? Milestones. Claim reward. Uh, Apex, when do I unlock my first dungeon? Like, is it like high level or do I get it like soon? transfer those i guess i described it badly well i mean we talked about it when lost i came out so that's like a long time ago
Uh, but it gave you crystals, so you got something back. Lineage 2 was like that. Items would break if you failed enchant. Oh, really? It might be in about lineage, I remember. Look at this blackout. I'm doing gathering. This is just for you. Hey, it gave me a level. I like crafting now. Because it gives me levels. Damn, I'm strong now. I'm getting so... Oops, I thought that was a chest. Die, crap. I don't know why that sent twice, my bad. I only see it once. It was because I had to like approve it. There was a word... You failed. The word you failed, it didn't like that. Because it feel the bot was thinking you told me you failed, like you know, it was a bad thing. Yeah. Bots nowadays. Snowflakes. <laughs> yeah. I only craft Gava if it's helping me with my progression. It's not that inventory I enjoyed. Okay, well I like it a little. But I think that's because I like to sell the resources I can become rich. Yeah, I think you're gonna like the, the this game as well because you can be crafting with it. It gives you level, you know. I got these stones which I need to like craft gear, so at least that's something. But it seems like what this game is, is what I wanted um, Is what I wanted New World to be. What the hell is that? I wanted that skull, that skull I had on the head was quite big. I wonder where that comes from. Investigate the small door. Which small door? Oh, never mind. Oh, I was not done, okay. I wasn't done. Investigate this small doll. Oh, a doll. I see. Not a doll. Uh, that one. Exit the wrecked ship. Okay. 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 There we go. Uh, Deacon, 
did you see you could transfer into a, a Shukobo? So we have a side quest over there. Okay, you saw it. Okay, okay, okay. So we got a side quest of that island over there. Find a stranded sailor. Okay. Let's do it. Moving shift to dash. Oh, so you can like swim really fast. I wonder what that ship is. Can I like jump on it? Yeah, okay, this is pretty cool. It just takes you around. Okay, so it's kind of like a cruise that just like swims around. It's, I mean, that's pretty cool. That I can go on a date with a Blackout and Deacon on this boat. <laughs> yeah, so now it says. You are wet. Oh boy, I'm wet. Read the letter near the stranded sailor. Okay. Just gotta find a way to get him up to him. There we go. This should do it. No, don't turn into a bird. sailor oh he's dead this must be the sailor who sent the letter in the bottle it's too late now how much longer can I survive this rock bro you literally have island you have land everywhere you could just swim over there <laughs> He's like, I am stuck here. Yeah, but there's a harbor over there. You could just swim for like five minutes and you would have been saved. But ban off. I guess I'm a bit too realistic now. Deacon lost like had it had had in cities and place, but no one used them. There was an achievement for it, and only like four per people four percent people did it. Had it. See he never learned to swim. Inst to death. That's probably true then. So, Deacon, I feel like the boat thing is different from this game to Lost Ark. You know, Lost Ark you see from above. It's not interesting to be like sailed around on a boat because you just see from the top. You just basically see the water around the boat. That's it. Like, okay. But here you can be in the boat and you can look around and see the world. I feel like it's going to be more tempting, like more... You know what I mean? Like people want to like enjoy the boat even more. Uh, examine the shipwreck treasure chest. Okay. So where was that? That was here. Just on the other side. If this game has player boats, I mean, 
video I spend most of the time at my sea. Ah. Oh my god, I did hear that someone taking me on a sexy boat trip. You know I will. You know I will. Yeah, naked boat trip. Yep. The requirement is that no one has arm on. Do the boats have steam rooms? Uh, that one didn't have one. What now? Oh, okay. Wait, what? Ask Lord Aid Dave at Lord's residence about Harney. Okay. So wait, so both quests. Okay, so both quests are all there. And now we have a quest where we need to go here. And check the magic circle traces. Okay. Good to know. Hey, Banks, it's just as a gimmick transportation. Oh god, my map is just full of questers now. Hey Banks, would you say I should do all these blue questers? Or should I just like, you know, do the main campaign? Because that is suddenly a lot of blue questers. I had like two, but now I have like insane amount. Check the rewards, they are like a rear questers. Okay, yeah, so it, they don't like get saved in my quest log, it's more like, um, kind of like, I guess, like Guild Wars 2, where it's like. You get very stuff from them, but main quest line is best. But you will run into a couple of XP walls, I see. So it's not like a bad thing to do them. No, they give you tons of things. Okay, I'll just do them then. I mean, this is still better right now than playing, you know, uh, the same content in WoW, or I, I like I was thinking about even maybe starting a Guild Wars or Final like Final Fantasy, but playing this is like way better because it's new. I don't feel like I'm doing the same as always. Apex hey, saying, but I gotta run. It's one a.m. here. Yeah, it's it's also twelve a.m. here now. I'm still gonna I'm gonna play like a half hour more because I'm curious to see what's gonna happen. But uh, thank you so much for checking out the stream. I uh, uh, yeah, Bex. I'll be watching your stream um, next time I see you live on uh, the game as well. And thanks for all the tips, man. Sleep, sleep well. We need a steam room so we can sit in towels. <laughs> Anytime, man. Have fun. Yeah, thank you, man. Sleep well. Um, so, Blackguard, now you're talking about um, steam rooms. We, Me and my wife wasn't that, you know, um, spa vacation. And they had, you know, that thing called Sauna Goose. In Danish it's called Sauna Goose. Where you sit like a lot of people in a sauna. And a guy, he puts like oil, on, like frozen oil. On the, some, you know, the warm stones. And then it gets like all this oil gets like the, the, the smell gets all around the room. And then he has like a very big like, whatever it's called, wave thing stuff. And then he just like waves around the air in the room and you just get all those oil smells and it's it's really warm sauna goose nah hold on hold on hold on hold on translate sauna goose sauna goose oh yeah it's
Eddie said you just followed. Eddie, thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Good to see you, man. Oh, yeah, some kind of like instanced. Look for fresh fish. I mean, that one looks pretty fresh. Place the fish on the road. We gonna summon some kind of like fish monster? Oh, over oh, here. Yeah. I mean, I think it would be cooked to goose, steam room, and a snack. Like a cocktail or something. While in a steam room, that'll be good. Hide behind the box and wait for the cat. Oh god, have we become this... Um... Okay. Check what distressed wizard left behind. Maybe this can be used to follow the cats. Hide behind the box without getting caught by the cat. Oh, over there. This is one of the quests that you don't want to mess up, because then you have to do it all the way again. I remember quests like this in Lost Ark. Like, okay, I'm going to sleep now. Time to dream about boats and roast. <laughs> well, uh, sleep well, man. Sleep well. Enjoy your dreams about steam rooms and boats. What the hell? So the cat was actually just a evil guy? But yeah, thank you for being here, Blackout, and sleep well, man. Nice. Level 10. I'm impressed how well the game is running. Like, you know, for real, the game is running really well. Um, you know, since I'm on a VPN to Korea, but I don't feel any lag at all. It just like runs so well. It is UI. Wait, you can't change the the chat. Oh. 
like C, okay. Auto translate. So you can make it the translate messages, that's fun. Alright, let's go to the main quest. Wolf time. It's wolfing time! Hi, uh, hey, hey user, welcome to the stream on TikTok. Is this Diablo? No, 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 it's called Throne and Liberty. It's called Throne and Liberty. Now we are here. I'm actually live on two other platforms, which I don't have the chat open for. Yeah, no one has been chatting on the chat or on Kick at all. And on Live Space, chat open for. Yeah, no one has been chatting on the chat or on. No, we don't have anyone else on Live Space. Ah, da 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 da. So I think I have to go inside the house here. There we go. And I should have two questers. Speak to the guild merchant Roberto. I'm still watching. Hey, Kaylan. So now you can get your uh, own liberty fix from me. Yeah, no worries, no worries. You are more than welcome to just sit and enjoy. So this is like the different guilds. Enter password. Okay. Just play. What would it Can I like create a guild? Nah, it's not the same as playing myself. Yeah, I know what you mean, I know what you mean. Of course it would have been more fun to like play yourself, but uh... This guy has a lot of guilds. ET-010, ET-05, ET-055. They are a bit hardcore, huh? So if we create a guild called Grayskull Gamers. Oh, it's too long. Okay, what about Grayskull? So Grayskull is a skull. Is there any skull emojis? This one is a skull emoji. Great guild. I do like the wolf a bit better, maybe. They have like an undead. They have guild pictures that you not you can't pick. I guess you can like unlock new guild pictures like later on the in the game. Yeah, that must be the answer. Okay, but we can like go with this and this and then call it Grey Skull. Raid guild. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait with creating a guild till um uh till I make a video about it. 
Oh wait, I can I can actually just explain what I'm doing right now and then just post that as a video. Okay, so uh, to create a guild, welcome to my video. You basically press G. You can either join a guild if you want. You can see that's either into password, request, and you can also you can see all request invite, but you can also press create guild. Then you can check you know like the different values here. Uh, select a logo. Let's pick this hammer. We can choose the colors. Let's make it gray because I want to call it. Oh shit! I there we go. I pressed out. Uh, white, gray. I'm calling gray skull. Create guild. Nice. Cool. So this is how you create a guild and we have a guild leader, we have members, we have a ranking, we have EXP. Uh, we just need our, we need our Discord link. Uh, Discord servers. Welcome. So, Grayskull. Feel free to join our Discord. Social PVX Guild. There we go. Did you see that Marla and my base in Palworld is called Castle Grayskull? Oh, really? Did you spell it with an A or E? Because you know the real one is with an A. But did you spell it with E? Because then it's the fake race call. Uh, so what do we have? We have an info memo, reward, relations. Oh, so you can like do relations with our guilds, allied, hostile, watched. Uh, it's not important. Oh, it's just messing. But yeah, I mean, the right way with the guild is like um, G R A Y. Uh, join method approval instant auto the client password instant. Ray Skull is a English social PBX build. Wait. Oh, okay. Cool. Hey, Sega. <laughs> like you haven't been here half hour ago and writing something like that. Uh, only permission settings on guild advisor gifts to the guild after five minutes bus load gifts to the guild after five minutes to guild to guild members okay I have and I think the first descendant was here not me yeah sure man sure Uh, so here, yeah. so yeah, Kaylin, you said why not uh, using the skull? Um, I don't like the skull. It's too small. It's too slim. So if we had this one here, it would be nice. But that require level six. This one is cool. Oh my god, this is the one we need. Level thirty. How are you liking the game so far? I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Defeat various monsters, dark pollution. Defeat various monsters, dark pollution. Guild skills, rewards, members. 
Info. Welcome to Grace Call. Social PvX skill. Feel free to join our Discord. Okay. Bam. I have my own guild now. Join the guild and acquire guild coin through guild resources, contribution, or guild contracts. Uh, so where's the quest now? Now I have to go up there. This quest here is basically here. Join the guild and acquire guild coin through guild resources, contribution or guild contract. Guild resource. I kind of want to know what that is. Wealth, emblem, settings. Defeat Animalia and Reckonus. Wait, what? Rankinus. So it says I can find Rankinus over here. Let's try. I want to see if I can like progress the guild quest. On my own. So how do I know what a rankiness is? Golden pyre. But just say, like, uh, so far I'm enjoying the game. There's a lot of things to the game. Okay, let's try and kill any of this to see if it progresses the quest. Ranginus. Golden Raya. Farm owners worries, retrieve herb. Well, I think I don't think it's that easy just to find. Yeah, I'll just do the quests and then I'll eventually come out of it. Um, so that quest is over there. This quest, okay. So I got like two people I need to talk with over this city. What a beautiful game. What's that guild contract? Dark Illusion. Defeat Animalia and Rankinus.
Uh, I'll eventually find them. What's the quest I have here? I have to get these beehives. What's that is really here? Two herb sacks. Place herb sacks at various places. Nice. Nice. And then theoretically, maybe I'll stake it now, just join the guild. Because I have set it to open. So everyone can just like, join. Oh. Hey, and we got like a live map on the, on the game like this. Kind of like Diablo has. Plenty of items. Craft books. Relationship. Okay, so I got one friend. Uh, leveling lock. Got some new items. Got something new and more. Swim. Oh, we got this one here. Nice. Special. Oh, we got this one as well. I wonder, like, you know. What's it? What, it's like, what is it for? So you just move into a monster, just for fun, like. Uh, character info. Oh, we got like titles. Looking for guild members. So now I have a title under my name saying look for guild members. Okay. Uh, we got skills. Oh, we got new passives. Um, magic, melee and ranged hit. Plus 0 0.5 current HP. Okay. Skill heal 9 during the day, skill damage over time at night. That's interesting, so... Okay. Yeah, why not? Oh, so you can upgrade these if you had a book for it. Same here, okay. And I'm getting these spells at level... 
what weapons are you using? I'm using a grain sword and a, a wand. So basically a Harry Potter and a great sword. It, the reason I'm, or why I'm using it is because it's basically the closest you get to a paladin. So my great sort of keys, of course, give me great sort of abilities, um, which is also very tanky melee spec. Um, and the wand is basically a healing spec. So I got like damage. I got a deep off. I got a AOE damage spell, but I also got a healing. So I'm basically like a paladin. And you know me, I love Paladins. I'm tired of Paladins in World of Warcraft because you know I played it so much. But if I can be a Paladin in a new game, heck yeah. Kaylin, I think we can we can definitely get a lot of fun in this game. I'm not talking about the version right now, but you know, once we actually get the the final game. So what is this battle pass? So there's like a free tier and a paid tier, which looks like it's giving a lot of like resources for crafting. And some different morph skins. Oh, and the last one also gives a skin, like a skin skin. Hey, I just got level three. When pressing the leaf that has the power of the world tree, it will enable enable an emidote heal the adventure. I see. I hope so. Yeah, yeah. Just running around in this world, the game is so beautiful, like, you know. It's a wonderful game. I need a screenshot. That goes for my Twitter. Redeem. Could you find your level map? Uh, I guess so. These are only level 3. I could also find like a level, you know, the same ups as me. But my quests have not like brought me there anyway, uh, right now. Crazy bay tuna. I think my main quest is gonna hit me over here, where I'm gonna meet level the same levels as me. I'm gonna go there in a second. I'm just finishing this quest and then I'll head up there. Enter Lion's Lab. See how special rainwater is made.
풍뎅이가 빗물을 젖으면 갑자기 난폭해질 수도 있으니 조심하세요. 오 oh, 와우. Wow. 그 explains why all your insects are so big. Because you use this. Order to order your plans. Uh, I would like a sandwich. Cool, let's go. We have to go up there now. Personal pin. Okay, you don't need those personal pins. Because I have a guild pin there. Crazy. Crazy bad tuna. I think we're gonna go to mobs now that is mine level. Oh, so because I am in a, in a guild, I get XP bonus 1%. That's cool. And then we can increase it even more. La 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 la. What's that? A bonfire, what is that? Oh, so these mobs are level 10, exactly the same level as me. I don't know if you saw that crazy uh, or if you had ads, but we just killed three the same level as me, which wasn't too difficult. Uh, look at that, it's an animalia. So basically that is what is gonna, you know, complete my quest, my guilt. There. Yeah, so now I've got four out of six hundred. <laughs> That's a lot of animals. So I wanted to see what that bonfire over there is. Next capture available. Tomorrow at 11 o'clock. When you sit at a bonfire, you will recover health and mana at a faster rate than normal. You can start a fire with F key and then sit down. Uh, look at how cozy that is. Sitting and getting full mana and HP at the nice bonfire. Mm. So nice. 
Beautiful. <laughs> exactly. Beautiful. Oh, this one is one level higher than me. Waypoint over there we can unlock. Ah, uh, hold on, give me two seconds. Content viewers. There we go, thank you. Uh, what's this guy? Bow and staff, interesting. Very beautiful. So now we can actually teleport to here and also the camp this waypoint gave like you know the map. So that stone Okay, so the old people they fight over the stone over there. So tomorrow at 11, Eric Gill can come and try conquer this one. Guild managers can occupy boon stones and rift stones to provide various benefits to the guild. You can purchase the guild flags required for occupying or guild supplies merchants. So there can be some really big fights. Oh, we got some rewards there. Thank you. Hello, dear. Happy, happy, happy. Okay, so... Oh, okay, so this basically teleported me back to the city. Escape teleports to return point. You can also enter escape. I see, so it's like a way every 15 minutes you can do this, just like, I guess, to get rid of people. If you're like getting selected or something like that. This character here, we can delete that one. Delete character. In three days, okay. Uh, screenshot. Oh. Screenshot. There we go. Alright. I am actually very impressed by this game. I did not expect to like it this much, but um, I like it way more than um, I had believed. So... This is definitely something I'm going to be playing the next couple of days, weeks, months. We'll see. I'm having a blast in it right now. I am, definitely. So, um, everyone who's watching right now, thank you so much for being here. And uh, it's almost 1 a.m. here now in Denmark, which means it's kind of time for me to go sleep. So again, thanks everyone for being here. Crazy Bane. Kaylin, Deacon, who else? Everyone's watching right now. Thank you. Yeah, good night, man. GG. Oh, Roscoe. Thank you, Dwalin. Have a good night. Good to see you, man. First time chatter. 
Thanks for the like views. Appreciate it, everyone. And um, remember, I am streaming. If you enjoyed my streams, um, I am streaming every Monday. Thanks for the follow, man. Appreciate it, Rusko. Thanks for the follow. Ruzga27 just followed. Yeah, thanks, man. So basically, I am streaming every Monday, every Wednesday, every Saturday, 8 p.m. CET. So if you want to watch me continue my saga in Throne and Liberty, I'll see you on Saturday. Yeah, it's Wednesday today, isn't it? Yeah, I'll see you on Saturday. So see you on Saturday, 8 p.m. CET. Thanks for following, man. And um, good night to you all. Peace out. Peace out. He's out.